Hey everybody, what's up? My name is Mr. S and you're watching Randomagery on YouTube. Today I got a short video for you. I got a couple things in the mail and I thought we'd unbox them on camera. So the first thing we got is an Okanal number no. 8 made out of Inox stainless steel. Look at that. For a long time now, I've been wanting to get a real French open L knife. I haven't bought it until now, but a couple days ago I saw it on uh, one of my favorite websites for getting kind of like camping gear, and that would be Sale. Sale Outdoors, to my knowledge, is a exclusively Canadian um, outdoor chain, so kind of like Bass Pro Shop. They sell everything, canoes, knives, uh, hunting equipment, like everything you can think of for outdoors. Uh, so I got an Openel. So, Openel, Savoy, France. I might be pronouncing that wrong, sorry. Uh, this is the number eight. Uh, blade is made out of Inox stainless steel. <clears throat> um, the blade is 8.5 centimeters long. Uh, Vir Vir Viro block double safety turning ring. Uh, pocket knife for outdoor activities, hiking, picnics, camping, uh, varnished wood handle, stainless steel blade. All right, and made in France. Right there at the top corner, it is made in France. It's a real one. So let's get this open. So what I got to open it is uh, I picked these up at Canadian Tire. <clears throat> it's a utility scissor setup. It's got a bunch of tools on it. Uh, it's got, you know, flathead screwdriver, bottle opener. It's got the walnut crackers in the middle. It, and the cool thing is, I didn't even know this when I first bought it. You can take it apart and turn it into two separate knives. So let's get this package open. So, uh, first impressions, it's very lightweight, which I was expecting. <clears throat> Nicely finished handle. Let's see. Easy enough to open. Got a nice solid lock on it. There is some uh, blemishes on the blade, even though it's brand new. I, I don't know if that's from the factory. Uh, it definitely was not returned. It's still sealed, or was sealed in the blister pack. It's got a nice lightweight feel to it. The blade is, uh, yeah, the blade is fairly um, centered, spot on. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, what I do want to know, because I've never had a real open L before, what kind of edge do you get on these? Feels pretty sharp. Let's do the paper test. Alright, paper test with my brand new open L. It's a bit of a rough edge, gonna be honest with you. Mm. Very, very thin bevels on this knife, edge bevels. Um, but you know what? It was $21, brand new, so not complaining. I'll probably sharpen it up and it'll be just fine. So that's pretty cool, my first real uh, French open L knife. Now the second thing I got, and this is uh, cheap beyond belief, but that's why I bought it. I didn't want to spend a lot of money. We have a Bolo machete with sheath. This was $12.99, $12.99 also on sale uh, from the sale store. It, uh, regular price is actually $12.99, so it's incredibly cheap. 
This is a world famous brand number 2200 Bolo Machete. Made in China. 15 inches uh, steel blade with wood handle. Doesn't even say what kind of steel. Probably alloy steel, knowing how cheap it is. Uh, sturdy canvas sheath, sheath with belt hook. I'm not sure how sturdy that sheath is going to be, but I uh, guess we'll find out. And that's all the information on there. So let's get it opened up. Look how easy it is just to open up. Alright, well the good thing is the blade is fairly centered. The bad thing is this handle is incredibly rough. It, it honestly feels like they cut out the handle on a bandsaw and didn't even bother to uh, sand it properly. Um, the nice thing is the blade does appear to uh, be mostly full tang, held in place with what looks like bolts like steel bolts. So the handle is definitely going to need some sanding. The blade is full of blemishes also. Like look at that. The edge, I'm guessing the edge is nothing special. There are burrs all down the edge. Oh my god. Pardon my language, but uh that is tall. The the edge bevels, they don't even come together. Well, you know what, that's okay. Because I was expect I, I was expecting that when I bought this, I would have to get my files and uh <clears throat> my sharpener and really like redo that thing. So it'll be a project for me. And then the sheath itself is this very basic kind of cloth sheath. Um, I guarantee you this is going to fall apart, the sheath, I mean. So, the sheath is also going to need some work. Got a plastic bag in here for some reason. So, uh, yeah, that's my quick unboxing video of today. We got the Bolo Machete, and we got the French Open L number 8. So, if you enjoyed the video, drop a like, subscribe. Say hello in the comments, and I'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching.